MacBook Air 2015 problem with this is it doesn't turn on the problem with this MacBook is the motherboard so let's replace the motherboard uh, the model number of this MacBook is A1465 2015 okay so let's open the MacBook let's remove the screw to four six eight ten screws at the back using a pentaloop screwdriver I'm gonna use my rubber mat like that and this one is long the two screws this one's longer and this one too and this one is the same with the other yeah it's shorter and just simply lift the cover just like that next thing we have to do is remove the battery just like that and then let's remove this battery there are one, two, three, four, five screws. This one's longer. And this one too. But a little bit shorter than this one. Okay, so we can remove the battery now. Like that. Next thing is we have to remove the SSD. Then Wi Fi card. Set this aside. Then the backlight cable, ribbon cable. Like that. And then this one, the keyboard. ribbon cable and then the speaker cable just lift it up on the other side this one the power cable this one and then this one all the cables Then the LCD, LBDS cable, and then remove it. Let's remove first the motherboard. This one. Here, and this one, and here. And this screw here. And let's remove this ribbon cable here. That and then pull. Now we can lift the motherboard. So, next thing is we will have to remove the heat. Okay. Let's replace it with a new one. We have a new motherboard here. Mm. 
this is not actually new it's just second hand also from ebay so we'll have to replace this one with this first we have to clean the heat sink and place a new silicon compound it actually the motherboard comes with a new silicon compound so first we have to clean this heat sink yeah. using a tissue it's clean it up so let's put the motherboard old motherboard aside and let's place this uh, heat sink in here but before that we have to put silicon compound okay just have to do like this The fan should be clean. I cleaned this already, so no need to clean. And then let's replace our motherboard. First, put it like this. the screws then plug the cables like that and then locked it so two plug it in And a video cable. And a wiper card. And the SSD. Then let's put back the battery. Let's try it first, if it's working. Put the cover back. Let's see if it works.
and there you go it's booting now that means it's working so now let's put back all the screws because it's working already the two long ones are here here one more there you go works perfectly fine thanks for watching